Hello friends, uh, today let's start off with uh, integration, the type wherein you have uh, a linear equation in the numerator and a quadratic equation in the denominator either inside a square root or without the square root. So I'll show you a method wherein you know you can save time and get the answer a, a little fast compared to the standard method. So whenever you have a quadratic equation in the denominator and in the numerator if you have a linear equation the standard method is that you write x plus 2 that is the linear equation is equal to a into a derivative of the quadratic which is in this case x square plus 2x plus 3 plus b. You write this and then you manipulate and you get the value of a and b. So what you do is you compare the coefficients of x. So on the left side the coefficient of x is 1. On the right side the coefficient of x is when you take the derivative you will get a into 2x plus 2 plus b. So the coefficient of x will be 2a. So a will be equal to half. Similarly if you compare the constants on left side you have 2 and on the right side you will have 2a plus b and you know the value of 2 uh, you know the value of a so that is a 2 into half so that is 2 equal to 1 plus b so the value of b is equal to 1 now in this question instead of x plus 2 you can write a into 2x plus 2 so that is 1 by 2 into 2x plus 2 plus b which is 1 upon root of x square plus 2x plus 3 and the reason we do this is that you can separate this and when you separate you the you will get the uh, the solution you will come closer to the solution that is half into 2x plus 2 upon root of x square plus 2x plus 3 plus you can write 1 upon root of x square plus 2x plus 3 and from here on you can go ahead and solve it with the standard method because here the derivative of this quadratic is here and uh, this can also be solved easily however if you want to skip this step this entire step let's say if you have this question in a competitive exam and you want to solve it directly so what you can do is you can skip this entire thing and what you can do is you can just go ahead and try this method wherein so I'll just do this in pink color so let's say in the numerator in the denominator you have x square plus 2x plus 3 now you just see what, what is the derivative of this part that is 2x plus 2 now what I'll do is to manipulate since it is 2x plus 2 and I need x so I don't want to change the question so I'll write this half here so half into 2x will make it x but half into 2 will make it 1 but I need 2 so that means I need to add 1 and now I got the same thing what I got here without using all these steps all these steps similarly let's see if I try this question let's see if I try this question what I'll do is I will I can use this method uh, linear is equal to a into derivative of quadratic plus b but I can use a shortcut so what is the shortcut see once again you write the denominator that is x square plus 4x plus 10 this denominator you take its derivative that is 2x plus 4 derivative of 10 is 0 you put a bracket now you got 2x but I need 5x so what I'll do is I'll put 5 here but 2 should not be there so I'll divide by 2 so now 5 by 2 into 2x will give me 5x but 5 by 2 into 4 so 5 by 2 into 4 will give me 10 but I need 3 so since this becomes 10 I'll write minus 7 now I can go ahead and solve it so if I use this method this particular method I would get value of a as 5 by 2 and value of b as minus 7 so this shortcut will help you save these steps this entire steps and this can assist you in uh, JE means CET or any other uh, competitive exam so I hope you liked uh, this video. For more such videos, uh, please subscribe and uh, like this video if you found it useful. Take care till next time. Bye-bye.